and welcome to Furrier's World, where we are back in Stone Block 2, and I'm down here in the main room, in the in the main place of doing things and stuff, because kind of think we need to focus on getting the machines better, and and that means we need we need um, more machines that can do things and stuff, and I'm thinking I'm leaning toward. Um, we we need induction smelters, is it? Is it? I, I, I can't remember. Induction furnace. No, it's, it's is that it? Is that what I'm after? That could be what I'm after. The smelter, making alloys is what we want to be we be getting at. Invar gear. Yeah, that does look like the thing we need. So let's let's see if we can crack on and get one of them, shall we? That might be a, a, a way forward. These chests fill up incredibly slowly with those trees on, but you know they fill up so. What can you say, eh? Jobs are good, eventually. So we need an induction... I, I'm trying to think how many we need. I'm, I'm tempted to go for five. Induction smelter, this one. Uh, so we'll need five of these, which is stone gears. One, two, three, four, five. And then we ramp that up to invar. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. And then we need five machine frames, which is five tin gears, which is okay. One, two, three, four, five more stone gears. You know, maybe, maybe I need to automate that sort of thing. Just, just making of these machine frames, because they take a little bit of time. I mean, that's, that's, I made six. That was a cock up. That was a cock up on my part. Copper gears, we're going to need ten. One, two, three, four, five. Wow, we're at it. We're at, we're at, out of, uh, we're just out. Okay, let's make more stone gears. There we go, plenty. And more copper gears. I don't know how many we I think we made two, so let's make another eight. There you go, we've got ten of the damn things now. Should do. Should have ten of them. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No question that that's going to work. I only needed five of them, but that's fine. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Perfect number. And then we need to somehow get these set and powered and attached to the ME system. I'm wondering where we could do this. I'm tempted to go upwards off the top of this run. We don't really need immediate access to it, so it might be beneficial to go upwards from here. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's try it. That was supposed to be the dirt. So let's go upwards, kind of over here somewhere, so that we're away from that, because we need to come across with that and, and tap on. So we want to go... Can we sit flat on it? Is it a good idea to sit flat? I don't think it's a good idea to sit flat on it. So we want one. Whoops, the daisy. Two, three... Four, five. There we go. Perfect. That's what we wanted to do. Now we're going to need some power on the back of these and some inputs and outputs. Import buses and uh, interfaces. I believe interfaces is what we is going to be needing on this bad boy. So let's get some power on it. Uh, conduit. Let's have a look. Conduit. Yes, we've got 73 of the melodic. And that's what we're using here. This is the melodic. This can this can shunt some significant power. Not an insignificant amount. Which is a good thing. So we can go bop, 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 and bop. And then they should all be hooked up. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Perfect. It's exactly what we wanted to see. I'm assuming if I can <laughs> jump onto this. Ah, no, they don't. Uh, we don't want to extract. We don't want to extract. We don't want to extract. We're just shoving power in there. That's all we're doing. And down at the bottom there, we want that. There we go. Now, this kind of redundant, kind of not redundant. There's, there's materials that come out of this that we need, uh, but we've already got tons of anyway. But there's other materials that we, we're going to need to pr produce that uh, don't come out of that sort of thing. 
because we, we've got our sieves. So we want invar, but I think we've got invar being made by a cow. Let's just check. Invar. Yeah, we've got a cow for invar. So we don't really need to produce invar. Uh, and then after invar... Let's have a look for upgrades. Uh, we want the thermal expansion upgrades. Oh, I clicked in the wrong place, didn't I? Upgrade. Upguard. That's not right. Upgrade. Wow. G-R-A-D. There we go. So we want the thermal expansion upgrades. Which is... These jobbies. So the hardened upgrade kit. The reinforced upgrade kit. The signal upgrade kit. And the resonant upgrade kit. So the hardened upgrade kit... Fairly straightforward, just invar, copper, and redstone. We can do that, no problem. This one is silver and electrum. I don't know if we have an electrum cow. And then we have electrum and signalum, and then cryothium dust. Cryothium dust could be a problem for us. Uh, hardened glass as well. We could do with getting this thing to produce hardened glass, because I'm fairly sure we haven't got any other means of making hardened glass. Let's go and have a quick look up here. We don't spend much time up here now. So we've got Electrum being made. We've got Energetic, that's not right. We've got Bronze. We've got Signalum, good, we've got Signalum. And I'm guessing we've got Dark Steel Enderium somewhere. We may have Enderium. I thought we had Enderium Cows. Not seeing Enderium. Maybe we don't have Enderium cows then. Hmm. That could be problematic. That could be a little bit, just a tad problematic. Okay. So, hardened glass is going to be the first one we, we have to do. Uh, this is storing obsidian. Kind of need this attached to the ME system in some way but there's no really convenient place for it to be attached. So we'll probably move this whole arrangement elsewhere. We'll take that, and we'll take all of these. Blop, blap, 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 blap. Good, good, good. Blap that out as well. We will have this machine, whatever this machine does, and we will have this. Oh, if I break that, we're going to be in a world of pain, aren't we? We don't want that. Really, we don't. Uh, we do want that, though. Good. Uh, that's an aqueous accumulator. I guess we need that for making the lava. I make, uh, that's my guess. Not the lava, the, the obsidian. So we'll probably need to replicate that system down here somewhere. I mean, there's plenty of room just, just kind of in the middle here. Uh, but we do need to attach it to the... ME system. Maybe we could go around this area, this neck of the woods with it. Uh, so there was that, and it was all being fed from one tank, which is just, you know, that's just the way it is. The tank can go quite high up. So if we shunt over here a ways and pop the tank on top, like so. There we go. A bit painful, but we achieved the objective. Objective achieved. So we're going to want uh, our drawer, which we got upstairs. We're going to need down here. I'm sure there's a way to move these drawers without breaking them, but I don't know what it is. There's one of these. We could try that. That might do it. It might do it. It might not, but it might. And then we're going to have potentially storage drawer I guess back here somewhere that's going to be the storage drawer and it's going to have the igneous extruder upon the top of it this thing needs power doesn't it okay uh, so that needs lava feeding into it it needs water feeding into it and we can get the water from back here somewhere we can do what we did up the other end here just a couple of blocks of water and the aqueous accumulator. Let's go see if we can move this, this storage drawer. And then we're just going to use this lava supply 
to make obsidian, which we can then pulverize, which we can then turn into other stuff. Okay, we can do this with the drawers. Look how strong I am. I can pick up an entire drawer full, full of obsidian. And obsidian is not a light rock. Obsidian is quite a hefty lump. And I'm just toting it round like it doesn't exist. Alright, we need to pop that down for a second. Uh, we need that to go. Uh, pick that up. Oink, and pop him down there. Good. That's exactly what we wanted. So that is making obsidian. Perfect. And this now all needs to be piped up. So we will go pipey, pipey, pipey. And we will go pipey, pipey. And we will go pipey, pipey. Good. That's some nice pipe work. Right there, that is some nice pipe work. So we want that to be... I'm assuming that can output automatically. I may have made a cock up there, but don't worry about it. Uh, we will ignore redstone signal. Then lava should go into there, and lava should fill that up. Perfect. Let's go get that other machine. Uh, we might pop this. It's a useful object to have. We might pop him in there. Just so we've got one. Because you know me, chances are I'll, I'll, I'll lose it, ruin it, break it, do something wrong. Because that's how I roll. Right, we'll break the machine, and then we need to get that water out of there. So we've got six buckets here, so that's good. We'll have water, oh, water, water. Okay, we've got, we've got some water there. Not entirely sure how much, but we got some. So this is a machine system setup that we've built before. So we're just repeating previous jobs. Alright, that can go there with a bucket of water either side. We only got one bucket. That's frustrating. I was pretty damn sure we'd got two buckets of water there. Boink, boink. But apparently we didn't. Apparently I was just moving water in and out of there. I thought we'd snaffled like five or six buckets of water, but apparently just the one. I was just moving the same source of water around all the time. Plop. Right. So that now. Oh, crap. Uh, don't hit it with a the bucket. There we go. So, okay, that's not getting any water. That's full of water. And that water is being output into this pipe. But is it going in the back? Uh, no. So we want output on the bottom, yes. Input on the top, yes. And input on the back. There we go. Water. And we just need to get some elastic trickery onto this bad boy, which we can we can bring out presumably here or hereabouts, or, or bring across and down here or hereabouts. That might be better. Let's get some smooth stone up in this place just to cover this all up. Just so we can't see it. So it just looks like it's magic. There, like that. Hidden stuff makes magic. Right, where are my conduits? Conduit. Ah, 64 of them. We've got 64 left. Exactly 64 left. Uh, you can have these. This, this. We didn't seem to use them this time, so... That's the thing. Right, we need to get up there, and then we, we can shin along once we're up there. Can't we? Yes. Decision made. That's a terrible place to try and climb up. Yeah, that's better. That's better. Right, now we're going to do the shinny, shinny, shinny backwards dance. Eh. 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 It's a bit janky. Uh, it's a lot janky. Something bad just happened in the game. That noise was not confidence inspiring. I think it's the mob grinders. They just trigger noises. I think we just have to accept that as a fact of life now. Ow. And then we go boop, 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 and boop. Then this needs to be insert only. It's powered. It's set to make lava. It's waiting on a redstone signal, we'll just do that. 
So hopefully this can just dump straight downwards. Yeah, it is. It's doing it. It's doing it. Jobs are good. Because I'm sure these machines auto-output anyway. So there we go. We've moved our lava supply down here. Our obsidian supply down here. We just need to tap this onto there. Which we can do easy enough. I think we've got all the bits we need. Emmy. Yeah, we've got four cables. And we've got an import bus. Ah, we just we, we want a storage bus, don't we? We don't want an import bus because we don't want to draw it all in. S T O R A G E storage bus on the wrong thing. As always, it's, it's furry his way. It is furry his way. We need a storage bus. Uh, are you? Any storage bus? That's the thing we want. So we want two pistons. Uh, chonk and chonk. Good, 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 good. That's some good chonking right there. Uh, we want one of them to be sticky. Good. And we want one of them. Emmy storage bus. Perfect. So that can go attached to that. And then, with these four cables, we should be able to go bop, bop, bop. That should turn dark. Like that and then this should say if I look for obsidian obsidian there we go 2000 ah, that's plenty plenty of obsidian good job good job for his world okay so we've got obsidian attached to our system it's being replenished all the time we might damage our lava supply but I'm not too worried about that I'm not worried too, too bad There's just no worry there so from Furrier's world for now I think we're gonna go with a cheery old ta-ta